Hey folks, welcome back. A little bit of King's Quest 7. Now, taking the tip that I had gotten. Oh, you can't go through that uh, Yes, there we are, can. Uh, 600 bad tempered weasels with crossbows right on the other side. Yeah, that's it. Weasels. Yes, yes. Well, thank you for the warning, little fellow. Oh, big fat hairy rat. Sarai, Sarai. In other very good news, Togov got pre-approved for his mortgage today. And so, hopefully he'll be getting a house soon. Now, the faux shop. The tip I had gotten was you need to uh, take the faux shop with a grain of salt, according to the yip-yip dude. And so, huh? Eh? <coughs> Salty. Now can I go through? Ha ha! Indeed. Great. Oh, hello, madam. Let me know if I can help you with anything. Uh... Good day, shopkeep. Good day, sir. I am Valenice of Daventry. Good day, madam. I am Ersatz Defoe, the owner of this fine establishment. Uh, may I show you something in particular? Hmm? Hmm? No, thank you. Pardon me for asking, Ersatz, but am I wrong in saying everything in your shop is... Well, how can I put this? Fake? <laughs> False? Synthetic? <laughs> Yes, you're absolutely right. I take pride in offering the widest selection of totally artificial merchandise available anywhere. Why, even I myself am a <laughs> mock turtle. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This isn't real. What do people do with false plants? I supply false plants to the Archduke's gardener. He always forgets to water the real ones. Of course, he did manage to set one of these on fire last week. Oh, lovely. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh. That chicken made of rubber. Yes, it is. It is the finest and stretchiest rubber chicken I've ever seen. I'd have to ask something very special in exchange for it. Well, we've got a couple things. We see that his mask wall is empty. Where in the world do you find all of these things? Oh, I just keep my eyes open for bargains with traveling peddlers and such. Can you believe some of those people think these treasures are junk? Uh, yes. But, what is this? What charming little books. What are you asking for them? Ah, I see you are a woman of good taste. The wit and wisdom of Fogderall has always been a bestseller. The price is one wooden nickel. All right. I'd like to purchase one of these books with a wooden nickel, please. Here you are, madam. Enjoy. Will do. Let's check it out. Is there nothing in it? Oh, that's that's great. Oh, I, I guess I really shouldn't be too surprised, but... Alright. What an unusual timepiece! Yes, it's a big hit with my canine clientele. They just can't keep their eyes off it. What are these spectacles for, good sir? They're just wonderful for hiding from the tax man. He misses me every time. <laughs> huh? 
Is this our King's Quest V owl? What a charming wooden owl. Is it a toy? Yes, I'm afraid so. We tried to hang it in a cornfield to scare the crows, but they just weren't impressed. We finally took the poor owl down when the crows drew a mustache on it. Now, let's see if you want a mask. Would you be interested in this lovely mask? It's just magnificent. For that, I'll give you the best thing in my store. Uh... The rubber chicken. Here, take this rubber chicken. Ah, thank you, I suppose. Sadly. Ah, feather. I'm really not quite sure about what leads this gives us. Okay. Well, I think we've gotten everything we can from here. For now, at least. Alright. This is our the cheese we still can't get. We have this what was this thing? Oh, the statue. Yes, yes. Wonder if that's used by the statues. I think that's where I, my train of thought was last time. That they were used with the statues by the uh by the muddy river. To do Otherwise, just explore around a little bit. Da, da, dum, dum, dum. The artwork in the game really is pretty nice. It's a little bit pixelated, I think, just from uh, probably the backwards compatibility. I'm not sure how it normally looks, but that's it actually is pretty nice. Can I jump here? No. Well, that'll teach me to go slogging through the mud. Okay. Darn. All right. Well, there was... what else was there? Ah, uh, there was a stone head that was sleeping. I wonder if I can tickle him with a feather. Looks like I can. But, before I do that, I want to cut the video off so that I have enough time. So as always, folks, thank you very much for watching, and please tune in to the next one. Thanks for watching, folks.